Good morning, friends. This is Cookie. I'm not at Hummingbird Heights Farm today. I am at Nikki's Farm, at Suburbia Farm in California, and I'm out here helping her pack. So she's moving to Georgia on a big lot. So here's her morning routine. She's helping me learn to be a farm girl. Tilly's having her breakfast. And Charlie, wolfing it down. So, morning routine is we get up, walk down, around the pool, head through the garage, change our shoes to our smug our smugglers. My set. He's ahead of me. She's already out there getting the goats ready. You have to have something to protect them all. Poop. This is my training for getting to do all this. We're going to go do the milking. She's getting the goats out. Taking you for a little hike down her. It's very cloudy out. It's the June gloom. It's not June, but we got the gloom. It's cool, comfortable. Don't have this in Arizona. Get the latch going. And now we're in the barnyard. Our sentinel, Jeffrey, the llama, stays out in the middle area all night and keeps an eye for predators. Hey, Jeffrey. Sure. Jeffrey, are you eyeballing me? Are you eyeballing me? Do I have treats for you? Not right now. Daniel the cat. The barn cat does not let you pet him. He takes, takes care of business around the farm. Keeps it critter free. Uh-oh. The hose has jumped out. Alright. And that's to fill the horse trough is full for the horses. Here's a baby. No star. What? You want treats? I don't have treats. Maybe later. Bring you some little carrot trimmings. They got a pecan tree in the center. And this is their trough where they put the hay for the horses. Oh, you're so interested. Oh, yes, you are. What are you up to? You're going to follow me down here, aren't you? And there's your mama. Come here, girl. Come here. Hey, Noir. You're dusty. You're so sweet. Honry, little girl. And there's Jeremy's tractor. With the chicken coop. We got a little egg gathering basket. Nikki, you're on candid camera. Oh but it's mostly for the chickens. They're getting their water. Girls, the lovely ladies keep Nikki and eggs. Would you say you have 22 now? 22 birds. Um, just looking for little things and all the This is where Jeffrey stays during the day, guards the chickens so that the coyotes don't come in and other critters. Ladies. She's 
got some great avocado trees. This is the area that is her garden. One of my favorite places to hang out. And she's got some mint. Three different kinds of mint plants in here. Look at these gorgeous raspberries. This one's a blackberry plant. And we've got some chamomile. These are some of her native plants. She's got these are gonna be given away to probably family and friends before she goes. And I forget what kind that is. But these are her blueberry plants. They, I had to cut them back a little, get them a little healthier. They're come, gonna come back. This is a, what is this? Oh my goodness. It's great for pollinating. It's just overgrown. The bees love this right here. And her artichoke. Her artichokes have gone to seed. They've opened up into these gorgeous flowers. And then the seeds just come off right here. Each of these is a seed. So all of this down here is the seed pod the other one it's all it bent over and exploded so all of this is seed pod so her, these are past their prime but that's what they do they just give up their seeds these are all in gorgeous bloom look at the pretty vibrant purple flowers so pretty if you don't harvest them this is what you get her pepper plants, she's got some padrone, what's this, um, ancho, poblano, serrano. So since she's moving, she's just let these, these are just going to stay and they're past their prime. But here's her little potting table cute little area. So she's getting ready to go. I'm going to miss her. So helping her pack up her kitchen and stuff. She's not even going to be here another month. Hey ladies. Here's the goaties. Hey sweetie. What's up? Here's the one little mama who is in milk. She's getting... What? You gonna get milk today? What's up? Come see me. What? It's gonna get out into your cage. Are you hiding in there? Are you hiding out? Are you waiting for your food? This is their little play yard. They jump all over this stuff. Jeffries. Out here just hanging out, buddy. Here they come. What's up, baby? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? I love your ears. You love your ears. You're so soft. It's like bunny ears. <laughs> the little white one is the noisy one. Jeffrey's gonna be 
put back in with the chickens now. He knows where the food is. Look at him. Come on over, Jeffrey. Come and eat. Go guard those chickens. Oh, they're excited. Cracks me up how he chews. <laughs> Mamas are not super friendly and you want them to be that way because they keep the predators away. They are on guard. He's like a little walking blanket. I called him Jeffrey because he's got his spots. He, his neck is so tall. He looks a little bit like a giraffe. Go for that, girls. Eyeballing me, the chicken. So this is about day five. Oh, I missed you putting the goat in. <laughs> Wasn't paying attention. All right, there goes the goats. They get to go into the big play area. Give them our food. What? Get your other food. It's gonna be much better. Here comes the little baby boy. Hey, buddy. Hello. Hello. And then he gets to go in with Jeffrey and the chickens. So he's, because he's getting a little randy these days, so he needs to be separated from the girls. So she's on the on the little goat stand with her little goodies. She loves loves going up there because she gets her treats. Yes, you do. So Nikki just cleaned off her little udders. And she's small, so she's got her little little cup that has a little screen on it. So about how much does she get per day? About a pint. About a pint? You just milk her in the morning? Yeah, she would just give more if I did twice a day. Yeah. But I'm lazy. <laughs> and that's enough for us. And her baby's nut. This this is actually her baby. Uh, she had a single, and this is her first kitten. So next time around, she'll probably have higher production. Yeah. Well, you said she's still not full grown. She's no, she's full grown. I mean, she's, I mean, she'll get a little bit bigger, but she's grown enough to have kids. Yeah. You said she might get taller? No, she'll just kind of fill in. Okay. Fill out. But this little guy, he should get bigger. He still looks a little bit furry. He's got like a little ridge on his back. You said the boys kind of have that ridge. Oh. And this is the little wide body. What? Ah, you try to eat my ring? You little stinker, you. <laughs> you little stinker, you. Got my blitzy diamond ring that he he thought he might take a nibble. Shiny objects. Aww. What are you up to over there? Little wide body. She hasn't had any kids. She doesn't seem to be able to have any. Maybe because she's so little wide body there. You can say she's fat. She's not a wide body. She's, she's a, too fat. She's a wide body. <laughs> no, she's too fat. <laughs> she's a little too fat. She gets a, a hard to control one eating too much over the others, other than separating them out. So they're getting their, their extra grain, their extra nutrients. Get their pellets. Their pellets. 
Ah, okay. Grain, grain for the milking mamas. Pellets for these guys. But the wide body doesn't get... What, what is it? What do you call her? Belly. Belly? You call her Belly? <laughs> I, I don't remember all the names. I'm terrible. Hey, if I can't remember my students' names, how am I going to remember goat names? What? You're just very interested in what's going on here. Yes, you are. Yeah, so. Just about done. Try and get as much. Try and get her as cleaned out so she doesn't have Don't excess. Want any infections. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I didn't take long. The bigger ones have more of them, right? Yeah. And so what kind is she? Nigerian dwarf. Okay. And the bigger eared ones, those are the Nubians? Mini Nubians. Mini Nubians. So they're a cross between a Nubian and a Nigerian. And a Nigerian. What? All right. Breakfast oh, oh. Got the treats. Oh. Treats. Oh, I know. You don't need to show your nose in there. Get a half one because you're tiny. The little guy. That was good, huh? Those are like probiotics? Yeah, little probiotic cookies. Yeah. Keep them healthy. That's not me digesting good. Oh, you were going to do something with the. Uh, Oh, yeah, baking baking soda. soda that goes in the little bin so that yeah the little boy had a tummy ache it was acting kind of weird so I guess they they self medicate if they need stuff self supplement self supplement self medicate yeah, doesn't sound good <laughs> free choice minerals oh she's still eating okay. so Nikki's been teaching me all this stuff. Falling around day and night over here. Since somewhere down the line, I'm going to have some critters, starting with turkeys. Similar to chickens, but they are a whole different. He's nibbling it, he's licking at it. Are you done? Hi. Well, are you saying hi to everybody? There you go. Did Jeremy build this for you? No, we bought it. You bought it? There's kits, uh, build kits, like plans that you can buy. Mm -hmm. Come on, let's go. You get to go hang out with the boys. Oh, there's the escapee. Every day she gets out and she figures out a way to get into the goat barn. And she wants to lay her eggs in there. And so she's got her little, her little method. Let's see if we can catch her <laughs> it's taken us days to figure out how does she get in there <laughs> she's got her little step up method because the bars are too tiny down there she can't get in but she's got it figured out go ahead oh you're watching me aren't you okay oh she thinks she saw you go that way. Where do you think you're going? <laughs> She's mad. She's like, I want in there. So the goat panels are made to where they're narrower at the bottom and then bigger, but she's figured out she can get... I can't remember. I think these might be the swine panels. Oh, really? I okay. Think the swine ones get narrower. There's different heights and different size holes for sheep, swine, cattle, horse. Yeah. Well, I had gotten one of these too because they were a little bit narrower. Or yeah, was... there's some that have the same size hole all the way up and down. Uh huh. Yeah, those are the cattle panels because that's usually what I get for my arch panels for my didn't get in, did you? Because ah, we're watching you. You're trying. You're so frustrated. 
Okay. We're not making it easy for you, though. You're just missing it. You just got to go one more square. Oh, I see right here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's she funny. Could go right in right there. She could go in right here if she just... But then there's the goats there, so... <laughs> oh, you two. You just knocked out and buttoned each other. Oh, boy. Oh, you're just showing off. Don't be such a bully. So, don't be such a bully. What? He is such a pretty girl. Look at the little feathers on their feet. That's a pretty one. Look at you. Look at you. Well, the horses got their hay. They don't, they don't care anything about what we're doing. And they're, they're building new homes right in back. This property out back used to be a section of the Norovia Nursery. And all this is getting built up. Giant properties. So there used to be just an open field here when all the other side is homes that they built up. So here's all their farm, their stalls. This is where she keeps all of her hay. Hay and alfalfa. What lighting in here is terrible. All right. And all this is going to be moved. There's one of the other horse stalls here. Weird lighting. Well, the people buying this property have decided they want the horse stalls, and they're going to be they're bringing a horse to. They're very excited. And it's nice to know somebody's going to be taking over and loving the property like they have. All of this infrastructure, they've built this as they've gone. So they've been in here for six years. This structure was here. So the, the goat barn and the horse stalls. But they've added all this around. All right, we got their hay. We're all ready to go. All right, so back, back to getting our coffee, and we'll see you later. Thanks for hanging out.